My people, my people. I'm here to sing a new song. I'm not here to sing an old song. If we keep doing this politics the same old way, we shall be getting the same old result. Your Excellency, Mr. President, my President, Madam President, Vice President, leaders of our nation, leaders of our party, first let me start by thanking God Almighty that I'm here with you today. Because if this convention has taken place when it was scheduled to take place on the 30th, I wouldn't have been here with you because I was somewhere in detention. But thank God Almighty that God in His infinite mercy saw us postpone this convention. Hence, I'm here and I'm here to address you. I'm not privileged to be one of those who made the list of preferred candidates of this convention. Neither do I enjoy the blessings of the mighty and high in our society. In fact, I'm the bestest of them all. I'm an ordinary Nigerian who depends on the people to be elected and for the people as my strength and the, for the people to serve. The people are my strength in this case. I'd like to remind all of us again that power is a trust which can only be justified when used for the benefit of the common man. You must hear me and hear me out again. This nation this time must get it right. I want to say to you, my delegates, especially those of you in partnership, the hour has come, the die is cast. You must search your conscience. If possible, make phone calls back to your family and ask them, what must I do with the vote that I have? Lest you go back again, wallowing in hunger and poverty, which have left you in perpetual suffering. I hate injustice and I hate poverty. I have covenant with God Almighty that when he blesses me, I shall bless others. And when he gives me, I must share with those who do not have. Because of my own, I can do nothing. But I can do all things through God who gives me strength. Gentlemen, ladies and gentlemen, my insistence in politics, after my traverse in politics, having formed this party, the APC, I have every reason to quit politics. But when I remember the poor, the widows, the sick, the needy, our nation bleeding, when I remember the insurgents, then I have reason to come back. I'm here to serve you. I've run for this presidency the third time. And I lack nothing. And I'm not in this presidency for primitive accumulation of wealth. I'm not here to buy cars or buy aircraft. I'm not here for anything. I'm here for one thing. To save the lives of the numerous poor Nigerians while uniting this nation. Nigeria must hear and hear me out. Today, my dear delegates, destiny has bestowed on you the honorous responsibility to decide for us who shall fly the flag of our party. You must never do that with sentiments. Let me tell you, all this dramatic political jingoism, which is going on here, does not address the matter before us. I don't want anyone to step down for me. If you can step down the sufferings of the masses of Nigeria.
I'm qualified. In the three arms of government, I'm a lawyer with master's degree. I have, I have experience in judiciary. I'm a former governor of Imo State, two times. I have experience in the executive. And I'm a sitting senator. I have experience in the legislature. I have this experience in all aspects of our nation. So to you, my delegates, thank God that this power today is not in the hand of the higher mighty. It's in your hand. I don't know what they may have told you. I don't know what they have myself said to you. You must think twice before you cast this vote. Because when you go back, we're in poverty and anger and hunger. No one is there with you. I'm your best partner. I hear every aspirant here saying, I will, I will, I will. I don't say I will. I say I have done it. Listen, let me boast, be boast for the first time. I'm the commander of free education who saw children not going to school, provided school for them. I don't want to see Nigeria who started to go now. I told you, I'm not going to see you. I'm not going to see you. I'm not going to see you when they are pirochas. I'm not going to see you. I'm not going to see you. Duk me suni man takra shuga ban kasan nan Wallahi bilahi lazi Basu se masalan are waba Basu se nderijan are waba Ni rochas danji kan sokoto Na se masalan are waba Kutambe sukuna Kuma sutambe da Me kuntaba ima are waba Yenzuba to anzo siyasa seku seku tasha seku na hau kwa ina ati ya baku Korea kuhime de Korea baku se mutunda ba se yenzu yoda ra che kaku yada umu nemji bom afumu rochas uka akbara kwa isi keje kwa ya onyemara su ya soni kwe Onye gama kwa nasu ya sona la. I speak again. Let me tell you those that are sparring. Everybody in this case. Let me tell you why I'm a better candidate. I hear people talk about track record. Believe me. Let me say this. And don't tell anybody anywhere. The truth is. Everyone contesting this election. Today. It's government that made them. None of them made wealth before government. So if they give you money, it's government money. But I, Rochas, Rochas was Rochas before politics. I have the business acumen to create wealth. And I can create wealth. My people, my people. God bless you.